horses, you know, people often say, is it worth, it's an expensive sport, is it worth my child really working at this and, and we can't buy my child a fancy horse and do this and that. Having worked with kids and horses for a long, long time now, the discipline, the self-discipline, the focus, the willingness to work hard towards a goal, not this goal necessarily, but maybe this goal down here, it's, it's, it's something that's going to be useful and helpful and uh, help make that child successful forever. I've had very few good, really good riders who have not gone on to be very successful in whatever they do. Whether, you know, some of them have become successful trainers. You know, I have one of my long, long-term students who's running the AIDS program for the Clinton Foundation in um, Swaziland. You know, whatever they're doing, they, they, they've developed such good habits by taking care of a horse, by not being able to take that tennis racket and throw it in the closet and forget about it. That horse is always there, always has to be cared for. Uh, learning to control their temper, it never works to be, to be uh, rough with a horse. So to me, I've never had one ever that had trouble with drugs. I've never had, I've had very, very few discipline problems with all of the kids that have lived with me and worked with me forever. There's not time for it. There's not energy for that. But then the other part of it is what a wonderful sport that you can be active and successful in for a long period of time. You're not aging out at age 16 or age 18 or age 25 or age 32 or age 55 or whatever. I mean, our vice president just got her USDF gold medal, meaning she got the good scores at Grand Prix just before she turned 70, shall we say. She's very proud, I can say her age, because she's, she's very proud of that. And to be able to reach the top levels of dressage at that age and still going strong, what a wonderful sport to be in, uh, because it is something, and you can leave it if you have to go to school or you raise a family and you can't do it, then you come back to it and it's, it can be such a delight in your life for, for uh, forever.